It's possible to export smooth 360 degree panoramas from SketchUp. But to do this you need two things. A Ruby script called Cubic Pano Out that allows you to export a set of six images representing the faces of a cube. And then you need some third party software to stitch this together into a panorama. And I'll show you an example of just such software called Pano VR, written by Garden Gnome Software. This is something you have to pay for, but I'll just show you how easy it is to create a panorama using this technique. I've opened this model of the Alhambra in Spain, and what I'm going to do is navigate over here into the courtyard, and then I'll press Option C to activate the camera tool, and I'll just stand here and look that way. And then I'll set my eye height up a little bit so that I'm realistically standing here in this courtyard. And then with the script loaded, which is written by John Wabey of Smustard, you can then go ahead and choose Camera, Cubic Pano Out. You need to set the resolution of your square images that you're exporting. And you have the option of creating pages, meaning scenes, from each one of these cubic images if you want and you have the option of whether or not you want to have the top image exported, that is, the sky. I'll say true, and click OK. We're prompted to select an image name, I'll just call this Alhambra, and click Save. Down here on the status bar, it's working. It says it's writing image 1, and now 2, and so on. It's going to work through all six square images and save them on the disk. As soon as the control loads, it starts auto-rotating. We can use the skin down here to navigate the panorama. You can even zoom in and zoom out. Of course, you don't necessarily need the skin because you can just drag in the panorama itself to move around. The shift key allows you to zoom in, and the command key allows you to zoom out. All in all, it's a very easy way of exporting panoramas from SketchUp.